been a while since you've been in this building too, has it not? Yeah, it has. A couple of seasons. I know it was. Uh, it was kind of nice last night going for dinner and you know seeing some old friends and uh, you know driving down memory lane a little bit. Um, but uh, yeah, had some great years here in Buffalo and. Um, Nice to be back in this building. It's been a while. Obviously, look back with fond memories as well. You had some very successful seasons uh, production-wise and team-wise. Yeah. I think, you know, I kind of went through the whole process. We uh, When I first started here, you know, a good playoff team, and then um, I was here through a little bit of the rebuild and, um, you know, and then and then left. So um, seen a lot of uh, change throughout this uh city this organization um and still obviously uh hope the best and wish the best for for this city and uh this organization two teams that are traveling a similar path as far as uh the organization and building is concerned what do you guys have to do here tonight rebounding from the loss against st louis but at the same time um sort of picking up where you've left off on the road where you've played very well of late yeah i think uh you know st louis they, they play a, a real tight playoff style game so you know there's things that we can take away from that game maybe on the learning side uh, that, that they do that we could um, you know maybe uh, take away and, and apply that to our game um, <clears throat> but we have been playing some good hockey lately um, I would say just continue with the good habits um, continue with what's made us successful um, the last month or so um, that's just playing hard, playing structured, um, you know, not try, not giving up much, and uh, you know, play well on special teams, and um, you know, kind of chip in everybody, everybody four lines all D. Goaltending's been good, so um, just stick with that formula. Tyler, talking to special teams, how do you guys? I know you got the goal, the power play goal a couple days ago. I know you can probably convert the, convert the five one three, but how do you try to build some momentum moving forward on the man advantage? Just, um, you know, stick to, uh, you know, what, what's been successful for us. You know, be detailed, uh, be diligent in our details, um, and, 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 you know, continue to study what the other team does and, and go from there. And I think the important thing on the power play is that you have to uh, outwork the other team. You know, it's easy to just kind of sit back and pass it around the perimeter, but I think if you're hungry, uh, you shoot first, you get pucks back, and, and outwork the other, the killers. Uh, I think that's the best uh, formula for success. Uh, Sabres have won two in a row here, but I'll see you guys got the best of them last time in that 5 nothing victory. What do you guys have to do again tonight to be successful against Buffalo? I think just play structured and, and work hard. You know, they, uh, they're they uh, a young team that uh, you know, plays pretty freely, so I think uh, for us, we, we just have to work as hard as we can uh, you know we've got quite a few injuries uh, so it's going to take you know everybody on the team to really dial in the structure and the systems and and uh, you know uh, be focused on on where we're supposed to be all over the ice and that'll be the uh, most important thing for sure it's it's one thing for one or two players and the last one for me here one or two players come back to play an old team there's more than a handful of guys playing an old goaltender, and obviously Craig yeah. has meant so much to the organization. Is there much chatter in the locker room going up against a, a guy who was a, you know, a, a teammate of uh, so many for so long? Yeah, you know, as we just saw Craig out there, it's nice to see him. Um, he's a great goaltender, you know, played with him a couple of years ago in Ottawa, and uh, he's a veteran, he's smart, he plays... Uh, yeah, an intelligent game in net. He's patient, so um, I think the key for any goalie though is to, you know, try to pepper as many pucks on that as you can with traffic. So that's no different with uh, Andy as it is with uh, any other goalie.